This video is for uh, my friend Yuri, kazoo maker in Israel. I'm showing Yuri, uh, Yuri my uh, dryer box I made out of an old steamer trunk. You notice in the top uh, left hand corner up here in this side there's a vent hole that's uh, blowing the uh, air out, keeping the air circulated in the box. Now I walk around here and uh, back here is where I bring the air in and this is just a uh, computer uh, vent fan that I wired in bolted to the box. I move back around here again and if you open it up you'll see that inside here this is a uh, flashing material you'd use on a house or, or a roof then uh, duct tape, metal duct tape for air conditioning that I made to form a baffle where the air comes in from the fan, blows into here, and goes out here, and heat is generated from uh, this 100-watt uh, light bulb I use in this one. Now, I made sure when I put this uh, uh, receptacle in, or bulb, bulb receptacle, whatever you want to call it, it's rated for 250 watts, and it's metal. It's not anything that would melt or have problems if it got hot. And I keep a little barometer in... Uh, temperature or uh, thermometer in here so if it looks like I'm gonna be getting well over a hundred degrees what I'll do is instead of completely shutting this up I'll just leave it the door cracked and uh, let it pull even more air in but I don't like it to get above a hundred uh, around a hundred is really really what I found works best and like I was saying I use it for uh, curing uh, finishes on the kazoos and other small instruments. Uh, some uh, things like finger pianos and finger tappers and jaw bones and stuff that I seal with uh, polyurethane, I'll uh, dry those in here too. And it speeds the dry time up significantly. I can uh, uh, say with polyurethane on finger tappers, I can go from a 12 hour curing time to a, a two to three hour curing time so I can get the second coat on faster. And uh, this is based on the design of a uh, dryer building at my local sawmill. I'll have a picture attached for this video for you to see it. In fact, uh, Bob down at the sawmill sketched me out a little design for this one based on the design he used for his building. But you can use it for drying wood. You can use it for uh, curing uh, seals. It's just a nice little handy thing to have around. Alright, I hope this helps you, Yuri. You take care. I'll talk to you later.